by that root. So for part A, I'm going to multiply top and bottom of my fraction by root 5. When timesing fractions, I just times the tops and times the bottoms. So 10 times root 5 is simply 10 root 5. And the bottom, we should know that root 5 multiplied by itself is simply 5. Simplifying our fraction, here we can see 10 over 5. Well, 10 divided by 5 is 2. Hence, my final answer is going to be 2 root 5. For part B, again, I was going to have one term on the bottom. To rationalise, I just multiply the top and the bottom of my fraction by the root. In this case, I'm going to multiply the top and bottom by root 3. When times in fractions, I just multiply the tops and the bottom separately. 